January, we had a fresh snowfall, and we are out here at the 9-11 showing. And uh, just going to take some grab samples. This is an interesting area here. You can see how folded this is. And, uh, and then this dives down. You have massive sulfides in here. And this whole block here. This goes down. And over here, there's a contact between chloratized schist and your silicified schist. You can see all the banding. This is a giant quartz vein here. And this is massive sulfides, pyrite with chalcopyrite. And this extends all the way over to about here. These are big chunks underneath here of massive sulfides and this is your contact here and this heads down there in your area here where your chloratized rock is possibly the foot wall you have some nice chalcopyrite and this mineralization continues up around for about 100 meters around the corner what we're going to do is take some select grab samples from areas where it's mineralized. You can see we popped a hole in here. Calcopyrite stringers all throughout here. And what we're doing is taking a sample from our first area, which is right here. We are going to be sending seven grab samples in for XRF testing. So you can see the calcopyrite in there with some pyrite. And uh, I think we got our first sample. We're gonna break some chunks off to make it a little smaller. Move on to the next area. We are another 30 meters farther down the road, right where the road starts to turn. More stringers, chloratized here as well. And it starts to transition to your silicified rock just around the corner. And we are going to grab our second sample from right here. This is our third sample area here. J2 is going to try and pop this big boulder off. We're going to take a sample either way from this side of it. There we go. We got our sample. This is sample number four area here. This is a drill hole we popped in. He just pulled off some semi-massive sulfides and this is where our sample area is gonna be for number four. This is area number five, about four or five meters over. You can see this is the bulldozer trench put in 1967. Dozer showing is up in the middle there. And as you can see, they just barely missed this. There's a layer of oxidation on the top where all the sulfides are weathered out. This area here is our next sample area. This is uh, where the prime samples are. A lot of massive sulfides in here. And then our next sample area is going to be over here. Right in the ditch here you have quartz and sulfide stringers. And then our last sample is going to be up just around the corner. Final sample area here. Right here you got quartz veining. This is all quartz with silicified schist. Quartz veining, quartz veining, as you can see. And we're going to take our sample from here. This will be our seventh grab sample. And then we're going to go line up the samples back of the truck and take a look at all seven. And uh, we'll show you which ones we're going to be sending out for XRFs. Okay, we have our first sample here from area one. Grab sample.
part two of that sample. Pyrite and calcopyrite. We have area number two, calcopyrite stringers with minor pyrite. And this is the last piece in area two. You can see calcopyrite. Bit of boronite. This is from area three, the big giant bowler that he pulled off. You can see disseminated pyrite, and you also have stringers of calcopyrite. So what we're gonna do with this one actually is, because it's so big, we're just gonna break it in half right here and take a chunk like that. So that'll be the sample, what you're seeing right there. Again, calcopyrite, some boronite, and pyrite. And just so you can see, this is the other side of that sample. You can see the very nice mineralization. Some boronite in there. Calcopyrite, pyrite disseminated on the outside here. And area number four right there, we got these samples here. Quartz, some silicified schist, calcopyrite, and pyrite. And this is the second part of that sample that's going in. Mineralization all the way through. Area number five, you can see quartz veining, calcopyrite, pyrite, Second half of that sample, similar mineralization. And this is number six, pyrite and calcopyrite in quartz. And the final sample from way up on the hill up there, calcopyrite, some quartz, silicified schist, and a bunch of pyrite. Nice little chunk we pulled off. So those are our seven samples we're sending in to get XRF'd. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video.